Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I have something different for you, and it has to do with your stream setup. Today I have for you the GoV Smart LED Strip. They are a Wi-Fi and Bluetooth compatible LED strip that works with your smart home network. Turn off the office lights. Now this LED strip does not work directly with your stream. You gotta download a third-party software called Lumia Stream, and there's both a paid and a free version that you can use, but I'll be showing you those later in this video. Now I installed these with the Muzada LED channel system. All these products can be found on Amazon and the links are located in the description below. Now they are affiliate links and anything that you purchase from those links will greatly help out the channel so I can bring you more content like this. If you don't have the ability to cut through the aluminum channel, you might be better off getting different links to suit your needs. A cheap hacksaw can cut right through these fairly easy and I used a pair of heavy scissors for the cover lenses. Once all my channels were cut to the desired lengths, I took a small drill bit and drilled pilot holes in the back of the storage cubes and screwed them in. These channels won't be connected to each other in my setup, so for the corners I followed the instructions from the insert that came with the LED strips and made sure to fold them and cross them as recommended. After I had my layout completed with the channel and the LED strips adhered inside, I pressed the covers on to complete the look. Now you're probably saying, Nick, I know how to install lights. How do I get them to work with my stream? We'll first have to connect the lights to your phone's Bluetooth and your home's Wi-Fi. To start, Govi made this pretty simple. Download the Govi Home app and prepare to add the device. As you can see here, there are a lot of module numbers to choose from. For my particular lights, it is H6159. My model number was found on page three of the Govi user manual. Once you click the model number, you can change the name. I am using Stream Room 2 for mine. It will automatically go to the Wi-Fi settings page, select your 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi band. That is the only one that the lights are compatible with. Type in your password for your Wi-Fi and then click done. At this point, if you have a searching for devices, she should say that she has found it. And you can add this to a group later if you like, like I have out, added mine to the office. So now that you got all that done, you can connect your lights to Lumia Stream. You got to create an account first. So once you have downloaded the app and using your streaming account to log in, mine would be Twitch, you'll get this screen. For now, I will click the no thanks button to show you what the free version has to offer. Then for a later video, I will do my due diligence and purchase the premium version for you guys because that needs its own video. Once on the dashboard, go down to the connections and we will start with your streaming services. I use stream elements, so I'll click on that and add it. You will get a pop-up of the stream elements webpage, log in with your respective streaming service, click authorize and your streaming service should be connected. Now for the lights. Go down to the light section, add new connections, and with the ones we just installed, we will select the GoV. As you can see, this works with a lot of other smart light systems. So you can choose other than Govi, but in my case, Govi is the best bang for your buck. Now this is the part that confused me a little. We have to request an API key from Govi. Do not let anyone else see your API key. On your app, go to the profile section, click settings in the top right, about us then, and apply for an API key. Type in your name, and for this reason, I just used Control My Lights with Stream, Lumia Stream, and then press Submit. My API key came instantly to my email address, and again, do not let anybody see your API key. Copy and paste that API key into Lumia app, and you should be all set. Now, once you're in the Alerts tab, um, you can do your uh, followers, your subscribers, your bits, hosts, and raids. You can have them all do different things. As for the follower, uh, I'm just gonna go through with the followers because you can have them all do the same thing. Um, there's a few things you can do. It's gonna do nothing. The lights can just turn off. Or you can have it change to a different solid color. You can have it change a scene, which I can't get either one of these to work. So if you know how, to, how these work, please let me know in the comments below on the free version. And you can get reactions like police, um, which is red, blue and RGB, which is literally red, green, blue, and then flash. So I'll show you the flash one here. This will be the flash. 
And it's just going to flash red. And it should last for four seconds. Then you got the police, which is going to do red and blue. Right there. And then RGB, like I said, red, green, blue. And you can also select an audio to go with these. So you go down here, you select audio, and then you'll have a pop-up. You're not going to be able to see it. And then I am going to select Do. And we will go ahead and save. And then we'll test follower. Do. <laughs> and just like that. It'll change the color back there and it'll play that sound. As you can see up here, you don't see donations. To add donations, you're going to come down here to stream elements. And stream labs might be here too, along with YouTube and a few other things. But this is how the stream elements works. It'll be here already if you've connected it to Lumia stream. So you'll come down here to the stream elements section and you can change it just like you could everything else. And you can also do the merch and item redemption in your shop if you have that set up on the stream elements side. Now I hope you guys liked this video and if you did, please click that like button. It really helps out the video. Leave a comment down below if this video did help you. Let me know how it did. And if I missed something, let me know down there too. And maybe I can include it in my next video for the premium paid version of this. I also stream live on Twitch every Sunday and Monday night at 5.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. And if you got any stream related questions, you can ask me there also. If you want a video to help you with the animation you just saw here, it should be one of the suggested video. And for the first time on this channel, I hope all of your streams go well. Dang it! Down to target. That was the last of them. Did I get him with a grenade? <laughs> oh my god! I got a silver buff. I gotta get out of here. I don't know what it is. No! Oh my gosh! Holy shit! Shotgun ammo here. If there wasn't another party there.